Okay. Just to show one amp, five volts. Five amp, one amp, five volts, one amp. Each has a three watt. I have a 16 of them. Sorry, 12 of them. I'm just too excited and my battery is going in the, in the camera. Anyway, 12 solar cells, serial combined, gives 6 volts. And 1 amp charging current. It can go up to 3 amp, but I have a limitation on this analog one. And the sun is very low, so it takes about 10 minutes, 15 minutes to charge 4.8 nickel cadmium 4 cells, 2.4 amp hour. So that's not bad. So every time it goes up or down, electricity changes goes up to 2.5 but I didn't want to go any further it's uh, magnificent so you can charge the batteries just on the solar power this is 1.5 kilograms 1.8 meters wingspan old model uh, solar Ruku Graupner has only two channel so my idea is to fly it with the battery and with the solar backup so charging recharging in flight up to 50 watts very nice very nice so if you if you tilt it up it goes up to as you can see up to 2 2 amp easy 2.5 which is magnificent very happy very happy <laughs> so the battery uh, voltage is uh, constantly rising up and the idea is that when it comes to uh, 5.9 5.8 or uh, close to 6 volts in uh, in inside resistance is gonna go up and then the the amp will go down and of course you're gonna be because it's gonna be a parallel connected you're gonna be flying it and recharging it and charge it while flying flying actually so main idea is just to have a backup battery in case the Sun goes down and still have a recharging power while you're flying so extending flying in thermal flying which is the basic idea of the whole plane 20 Five years ago almost I I have this plane and I'm gonna I'm gonna try it out soon one amp still and that's a horizontal position just as you see perfect and it's a November so it's not summer time summer time these solar cells are capable of producing 5 amp at 0 0.6 volt open voltage and open uh, like short current but short circuit current but still very nice okay my battery was more than sufficient to record all of this Nice. So the roof. Obsession is obsession. Maybe it is boring, but for people 
uh, who like this, they gonna understand. 5.6, 6, 5.7645, 7.65, should go up. Maybe it's resisting. Oh no, it's going up, still going up. Let's see what's gonna happen if we increase the amps. Up to two amps, just by tilting it. Let's go 2.5 amps. The voltage is shooting up, up 5.9. Nice. And it's like uh, 45 degrees because sun is almost behind the buildings. At the 2.3 amp, shows here on analog, 2.5. Ta da! <laughs> Solar power is nice, but you you need to have a backup. <laughs> now I'm okay. I can record. 5.8 volt. Zero eight nine amps. 5.7 volts. See how long is it working? Right now it's a pumping 5 watt or 0 08 amps, and the time is see 16 minutes. 16 minutes. Five eight. It's pretty cold outside. Uh, let's tilt it once more. Once again. To go to the two two amps again. That's six volt almost. Six volts. So I chose the twelve solar cells. These are the new solar cells. They have a three minus a three plus on the back side of the solar, and they produce a five amps under ideal in condition and zero five volt, five point five amp uh, of uh, power, like. Right now I'm holding it tilted, so it's making making two amps. Okay, this is see. So voltage is going down. That means the battery is charged, so it's resisting. Inner the resistance of the battery is going up, and then the, it's uh, automatically <coughs> controlling the the input uh, power. Let's see. Go up again. Okay, now it goes up. Voltage goes up to six volt. So, and luckily sun is going down too, behind the building, so I'm not going to be able to make any problems, because normally you charge it while you're flying, and then if you go to horizontal flight, it goes up and down while you go left and right, but it charges constantly at least a Let's see here, five uh, zero seven of five hundred six hundred milliamps. Right now, seven hundred milliamps. 
back to 5.8 and while you're using the rudders then you drain drain a little bit of electricity and then you should be okay and especially if you run these babies 3.8 oh it's 11 11 by 8 inches and the motor is 1200 revolutions per minute per volt KV and uh, yeah that's about it I love it just love it even if you go up or down if you go down a little bit so angle is gonna change. You still have like a hundred, hundred fifty milliamps, two hundred milliamps charge. Or if you go up, or the sun is higher and you're flying closer to the noon, then you have a one one point five amp for sure. Let me see how much I did put already. Eight point three watts right now. Pushing electricity inside and power. Eighteen minutes. Six hundred and forty. Six hundred and forty three milliamps only. And the battery is two point five. 2400 so it's plenty anyway it can really really increase your flying time of course you're gonna have increase weight but that's about it bye bye